and welcome back to God of War played on Blue Steroid. I found it. I mean, I didn't find it, but I found it on the Isle of Death. The missing artifact, oh, so... Let's get there. Oh, easy there. Atreus, follow me. Sorry, and... Can we? No, we can't jump down here. Maybe not. No, please, go down. They chose the boat, I don't know. Lemire, why don't you tell us the story of the giant that stole Thor's hammer? Happily, my boy. It involves your friend Freya, too, though I don't expect it's one she'd enjoy being reminded of. The giant was called Grim. And he proved cunning enough to make off with Mjolnir while the Thunder Lummock slept. Sadly for Grim, he didn't always think with his brain. Though he had robbed the greatest giant killer of his greatest weapon, he offered to trade it back to the Aesir in exchange for Freya as his bride. Now, at this point, Freya was married to Odin, and Odin, frankly, would have traded her for a sufficiently strong mead, but he saw an opportunity here. Thrym's palace was in Jotunheim, and only giants know the way. By agreeing to the marriage, they'd have to escort Freya back to their realm. So, Odin coerced Freya into using her Sather magics to conceal Thor, so he could sneak along with her and infiltrate Jotunheim. When the hammer was produced as the wedding dowry, Thor revealed himself. He took back Mjolnir and wasted no time in smashing Thrym's skull, followed by every other giant present for the festivities. The only thing that put a stop to it was Freya, who wanted no part of this massacre. She cast a powerful spell that hurtled them both out of Jotunheim with no means of return. Odin was livid, hoping that Thor's foothold in Jotunheim would become his own. And oh, would he ever revenge himself upon Freya. What is the point of this story, Head? Well, for Thrym, the lesson would be to keep his priorities straight. For Freya, it's that doing good has a price. For Thor, it's that no object of power makes you what you are. And if what you are is the biggest butchering bastard in the Nine Realms, nobody can take that away from you. Well... You can tell the story that's short and con concise, you know? But you must be made to do so. Um... Now... Let's look for the artifact. We are looking for for a corpse, that for sure they are always near corpses. Okay. Um maybe let's look from the highest point. There's a corpse here, but I don't see anything. The ship, I don't think so. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Can I reach it from here? Hmm. 
Aha. So that ends the collections of art, the collection of artifacts. Mm. Is there anything left? I don't think so. I mean, we still need to go. Oh, sorry, not this. Um, we still need to go to the uh, Alfheim. Find all the Jutner shrines. I haven't found one. I hate it. And res this one, I. Mm, I'm fairly sure this cannot be done. Unless. Until we end the game, I think. Um. Okay, but yeah, let's uh, go back to the shop. We'll go to Alfheim. We will uh, take care of that uh, treasure map. Uh, but first, maybe we can upgrade some of our weapons. Let's see. Are those the ciphers? I think those are. Hmm. Look. We can upgrade something. Expo. It's a shame that I cannot sell it to you. Attribution. Axe throw and oracle become incredibly powerful. Low perk activation chance to strike with a massively damaging explosion. A successful hit. Not that I have any way of doing that. I mean, for the sake of upgrading it. Okay, let's see. If I can get to. If I can get it. Okay, it already gives me higher stats. Sorry. And I know I won't upgrade you any further because we're n I'm not going back to the realm of... Uh, uh, to the realm of mist. I rage quit it and I don't and I'm not ashamed to hide it. Yeah. Hmm not no spell. Not Niflheim. Of course it's gonna be the last one we'll take. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's check it where it was. Uh, Island of Light. Okay, I see some drawing at the bottom and it looks over to the waterfall. Okay, I think it will be easiest to find a waterfall. 
and then check it from there. Actually, can I take it from here where there, there will be some waterfalls? Not really. I think it will be either somewhere here or here. If we are lucky, it will be earlier. But I doubt it. I'm not a, a lucky person. Oh. Is in the open, so that's definitely not this waterfall. The waterfall is seen from the left, the way it's here. So it can, can it be on the right? Kinda can, depends on the on which side we're looking at. Okay, let's start. Not this place. There's a little falls here. No visible waterfalls. If it's located somewhere inland, um, then my idea is destined to fail. Yeah. Okay. Unless, no, no, it wasn't in. Midgard. Once again, Island of Light. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It's definitely in Alfheim, okay? Mm -mm 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 -mm. It's at the cliffs, or maybe this is not a waterfall after all. There's some rubble up. Okay, it can be inland. Mm -hmm. And this is the, this is this can be inland actually. Um, so let's start with the, this. 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 It doesn't look like this outcropping. Hmm. Maybe it's something here after all. I mean, there's a waterfall, but there's no rubble up 
around here at all. I'll be right back. There's light elf outpost in the Midgard. God damn it. Okay, so this was a waste of time. Come on. But that's the thing that doesn't sit with me correctly, that there was... There's rubble in the water depicted in the map, but we do not see any rubble in here. I mean, well... The uh, light elves uh, part is clear, but a little bit misleading, which I really appreciate. I think all of the treasure maps are located in Midgard. I could be wrong. By the way, there's one thing I need from you guys. Let's do it. Uh, but let me check what was that. Um. We need traveler armor set and ancient armor set, whatever that means. Uh, yes. Respect of traveler. Yes, thank you. Thank you, I do. Traveler and ancient. Ancients. I mean, it's for the. Come on. Uh, it's only for the steam achievement uh, traveler. I think that's a keeper. I probably had it in my inventory but sold it. Looks amazing. Guess uh, why would I keep it? Um traveler. That's the Traveler armor set and Ancients. And that's the Ancients armor set. Thank you. Oh, by the way, um, I need to buy from you not enchantment, but resources. Not sell, buy. Resurrection stone, superior one. Thank you. Anyway, what nice uh, enchantment do you have? None. Okay, never mind. Now don't be a stranger. Sure, stranger danger, I understand. Una puta. No, thank you. I don't want to buy anything. I'm on my merry way back to. Midgard. There you go. Good seeing you again. Midgard, please. Okay, I will put the marker on map, so I know where to tell. We cannot teleport there. Great. 
Uh, the closest one will be on the tower. Oh, maybe we can take the boat. Maybe Mimir will tell us one of his stories. Hmm. That's always good to listen to. Um, no, we need to go down. In the meantime, I'll be looking out for oarsmen. Is there a story for the giant with the flaming sword? Sew up the brave. Of course. We've spoken so much of frost giants. It's about time we instead met the most fiery giant of all. Back when Emir first emerged from Ginungagoth, it was Suop who followed next. He came from Muspelheim, the Fire Realm. Bringing heat to the young cosmos, conjuring the sun from his primordial flame. But let's come back to that flaming sword, shall we? Suot the Brave forged his sword of flame for one purpose alone. To burn down Asgard when Ragnarok comes at last. His destiny is to fall at the hands of Thor and Odin. But in so doing, strike the blow that leaves their realm in ash and ruin. From that destruction, the world can be born anew. Until then, alone he waits in Muspelheim, never sleeping, ever honing his fiery blade. Brave, generous suit, who knows he lives but to his doom. All because he chooses to serve a grand cycle so much bigger than himself. To truly embrace your purpose and the patience and sacrifice it demands, is to ensure your day will come. Do you think we'll be there when that day comes? I've seen enough of war between the gods, but you, little brother, well, who can say? Okay, so what we are looking for is this. The sun, and we must look at... I think this? Oh, guys, come on. Will it be somewhere here? No, not this. There are pots. But well, okay, I don't know if it will be. Yeah, it will be. It's a bit lower. I think. Well, it's right here. Yay! So with that, oh, maybe we can upgrade our blades. Okay, but with that, I'm gonna end this part here. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive, and see you soon. Bye.